good. So here it's more just letting two good social dogs do our job for us. Hi bud. Good. So like a displacement sniff, so he's sniffing the ground, Ashton. So kind of concerned with like Goldman behind him. He's not that comfortable to let him sniff without looking at him. Was he, he good to walk? Is he sort of easy to walk? Ashton? Yeah, he just wants he's treats. He's looking up so at you the whole time. He wants treats. Yeah, he okay. just wants so treats. Treat motivated? He's good. So him I would put as maybe proximity sensitive. He doesn't really want to be that close. And that's where people go, he's standoffish, but he's a little more than that. It's Or mellow or something. He's not really oh, that. Oh, that's a good idea. But again, I don't like P minus, so. Yeah, it doesn't really teach what to do. What to do, what, yeah. It teaches what not to do. Yeah, yeah. So just a little bit of that, but more in the. It's, it's good for your timing because it's really hard to time it perfectly. Oh, that was so soft. Yeah, here. Yeah. So there, he's probably not going to like that. But Moby's kind of smart on that. I hope I got that on film. The cutoff signals are so hard for me to see. Like, Moby was teeing off in a play. Then Ashton said something and Moby backed off. <laughs> and she doesn't like it and they're all kind of semi getting it. Sorry girl. I guess you can't sunbathe right now. <laughs> Nobody's gonna play with Moby. He's checking him out for a play. He got lit so Ashton gave some licks back. Hi, bud. 